Now hey guys, welcome back to the channel, another Swiss 001 video, and welcome back, yeah, to Flight Simulator Fun with Swiss 001, and we are in the Flight Simulator, Microsoft Flight Simulator, indeed. Okay, now, welcome back, uh, well, we have a very interesting plane here that we're gonna talk about today, and that is the Cree Cree, and actually, we're going to go a little bit into actual detail about this plane. Yeah, this is probably the cheapest plane to build, it's also the smallest plane to build, one of the smallest plane that has ever flown, and it definitely is the smallest twin engine plane um, and yeah as you can tell it's a new addition to the Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 uh, yeah they recently came out with a new add-on for this plane it is very interesting indeed so let's just go ahead and fly it all right full power here there's not that much power but there we go Okay, that was almost a crash into the ocean, but there we go. We did not end up crashing into the ocean. That's good. All right, now that is the Cree Cree for you. This is an interesting plane. I think it was designed in France. Yes, uh, Cree Cree is actually a French name. I think it stands for cricket, and that's what this plane kind of does look like it, doesn't it? And as you can tell, it's quite a fun plane to fly, especially for $20,000. It's also considered an acrobatic plane. Well, especially a specific version of this exact plane. I mean, we even have a smoke cannon here, which we cannot use. Oh, oh, we can. Never mind. We have smoke? And uh, no, we don't have smoke. Yeah, this is actually a $15 add-on for this flight simulator. It does not have smoke. How does that come to be? Now, uh, what should I say about this plane? I mean, it is, after all, a plane. Uh, it's a very interesting one. It's n It doesn't have a lot of features, at least this one here. This very model. Um, you know, it has this one battery switch, which switches on and off the, <laughs> the radio device here. So, that's good. Uh, but no, this plane is not even advanced enough to have flaps, apparently. There's only a trim. Oh, never mind. It does have flaps. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, this plane does have flaps. That is good. Was not able to see it before, but it does have a flaps handle. Um, but apparently, it doesn't have a the designated flaps surface. You know what I mean? Literally, when you pull flaps, all that comes down is the ailerons, but they are synchronized while coming down. That makes sense, right? And well, as you can see, this plane is really tiny, especially if you compare this to a normal person. Jesus Christ. It is very very much tiny and the two engines that are driving it they are even more tiny and these are actually just kind of big rc plane <laughs> engines yes remote control plane engines and i mean we I do have to say there are remote control planes bigger than this actual plane that can transport an entire person now let's just imagine you want to fly this plane you want to buy this plane for again twenty thousand dollars and that's actually not going to be so easy because this plane um, is a kit plane Plane, meaning that you have to build it yourself. You can uh, buy plans for this plane and build it yourself, which more or less is safe. I've never really done, like, building my own plane that I fly in sounds kind of scary. I would not ever do that. Something that you can actually do, though, is buy planes that other people have built and then are trying to get rid of or something. That is something that's an option, and there are really cheap options out there. 20000 bucks again. Now, I was able to find some listings here on the internet here for an actual Cree Cree. Cree Cree for sale, and as you can see, it even, like, <laughs> compared to an entire house, looks super small. Yeah, this one is actually stationed in UK right now. Here it is compared to an actual person. This aircraft is tiny indeed. I don't know, there's not a price listed here, is there? Uh, that's kind of sad. Yeah, here was someone trying to sell one for $7,000 in 2007. There was one trying to buy one for 2500 bucks. Yeah, this plane is really cheap indeed and we've crashed as well I was in the browser that was not good yeah this plane is uh, really cheap indeed and honestly now I kind of like the idea of building your own kind of plane now this one actually goes quite fast we're at 150 knots which is quite a bit that's like 300 kilometers per hour very easily yeah so this plane actually is not half bad but since again you can literally build what you want I guess there's obviously also jet versions of this plane that's also here in the flight system later there's quite a few versions here that we can try out all right here it is <laughs> Cree Cree jet aircraft definitely the cheapest jet aircraft that there is uh let's just see what we can do with this one kind of looks like coca-cola cans in front jesus christ all right maybe we can test some of this plane's abilities to fly at interesting places let's go ahead and fly it at lukla or something because why the hell not i mean you could try to like fly around the world with this plane would not do it but you could 
That's the point. All right, welcome to Luke. Let's go ahead and fly our jet engine. Jesus Christ, these are like genuinely tiny, but actually this is quite a beautiful model here in the flight simulator, isn't it? I don't think I've ever actually flown properly to Lukla in the new Microsoft flight simulator before, and I'm pretty sure that Lukla doesn't look like this. Jesus Christ. Okay, that's another story. What we can tell already is that this plane is very quiet. Obviously, it doesn't have barely engines. <laughs> these actually look so tiny that you cannot like barely able to tell them. All right, let's go ahead and take off though which is not possible for some reason. All right, we are severely overrunning for some reason. I think this add-on plane, again, this is uh, a payware add-on, is kind of broken. So we have to cheat ourselves up into the air again because that has really not worked. Okay, this is, oh wow, this is now loud when it's actually in flight. But this is actually a really powerful plane now. A very, very nice acrobatic plane. And we almost stalled out to the ground there a second ago. But what we have here is actually a primary flight display now. There's still only one button that turns on and off the communication, but that's on the story. What we have is jet engines and quite a bit of power here. Let's go ahead and pull, for example, a loop. All right, there we go. And that has not worked, has it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, that is uh, the Cree Cree jet version for you. Actually, this is not half bad. Would I dare to fly this plane? I think I think this is actually quite fun. You know, this plane is actually flying at such a low speed and is so extremely light that unless if you would like fall apart in midair or something, you probably wouldn't have many accidents, right? Or at least you would not die on an accident. That's the good thing. And have I mentioned again how beautiful Microsoft Flight Simulator looks like in this valley as well? Jesus. Okay, now what else do we got? I think there's even like a, a ski version here, a water version that can actually fly on water. Yeah, here this one. This one actually has floats and I'm actually kind of scared to fly water like seaplanes um but let's try flying this plane or something all right we'll come aboard a proper seaplane now let's go ahead and land the ocean actually let's fulfill the dreams of sully let's go ahead and land this plane with the engines shut off in the water but now in a plane that can actually do it right Oh, wow, that, I was distracted by my phone. I, oh, wait, that was a major crash into water, but we've actually landed in water. And this is Dubai in the background, by the way. By the way, during the loading times, I found this channel here, Cricket Aviation. And he is actually posting tutorial videos on how to build this plane, which is really impressive. What is he doing here? Cree Cree Airplane Build Introduction, May 2020, not long ago. Introduction to my Cree Cree Airplane Build. So he's basically, um, I guess he's showing how he builds this plane, which is is very interesting. And here, for example, rear fuselage part two. And here's actually how he's building his own plane there. So I'm back to Jesus. I've built bigger RC models than that. <laughs> so yeah, that is the Cree Cree plane for you. Plane design for you, at least. Again, custom built plane. A very interesting topic, I think. Um, and well, yeah, the cheapest plane that you can get. This is what 20,000 bucks or maybe even less of a plane get to you. So yeah, guys, thank you for watching today's video, and I'll see you tomorrow. As always, good night.